Okay, this uh, video is about how to replace the uh, toilet seat. Uh, this one is uh, getting yucky and dirty. Mom doesn't, my wife doesn't want to clean them anymore. So you will she want me to replace this. Uh, before you replace it, you need to measure it out the width, the length of it. So you can buy the final one at the store. It had uh, the same size. You don't just go out there and pick whatever, and then it's going to be either too big or too small. Uh, so I measure it out. It's uh, this size. The length is about sixteen and a half, and the uh, width about forty. Uh, I forgot whatever it is, but I I did measure it out and um, went to store. And I pick up this uh, box right here. This box right here. Okay. And uh, I'm going to replace it. Okay. And first, uh, how do you replace it? First, you need to take these two of this off. I don't know if you can see it. On this side right here, it say uh, it have the side of the lock. It's closed and this side open and which it means you have to twist it like this okay so this one twist it like that and then open it up okay basically you just need to uh, a screwdriver a flathead screwdriver and poke in there and open it up actually if I can do it with right hand it better but my right hand is holding the camera so I'm trying to use the left hand and basically just pull it out. That's how it is. And here is uh, the piece. You can see better right here. See this side is uh, locked. This side open. So if you lock, you go to like this and open. You're going to turn it like this. Okay. And after you open, pop up the top, the cover up. Inside they have some kind of uh, plastic uh, screw. You can use either flathead screwdriver or Phillips screwdriver. But in this way, uh, the flathead I think uh, it seems work better than the uh, Phillips. So just untie it out, okay? Okay, after you untie the, uh, the screw, on the bottom it has some kind of bolt like this. It has a little uh, wing uh, sticking out. The reason for the wing is when you tie them in, you don't have to hold it. You don't have to hold the, the, um, this bolt right here because the wings will catch on the side of the toilet. So. Um, uh, after you uh, tie them up by hand, uh, you know, with this bolt, and you can tie them up with the uh, screwdriver, uh, flathead screwdriver on this side without anything have to hold this bolt because it, the uh, wing will uh, catch on the side of the toilet. So both of them are out. Uh, all you have to do is raise it up. It is. Here at the bottom of it, how it look like with this uh, plastic uh, screw. Okay, and now uh, what left need to be done is uh, I have to do clean this up a little bit and uh, ready to install the new one. Okay, here the new one. Uh, open it up. Put all the, the old one away. Here, uh, the new one, and it had the same the cover like that. It's about the same. You see it. It had the uh, lock on this side and open 
lock on this side so uh, you need to if, if you need to take it off you need to turn it on the left so you can pop it out and on the bottom it looks something like this and the hardware come in the back it has uh, two of those uh, plastic screw again and two of those bolts with the wing on it so it is about the same as the other one okay, okay so this is the, the old one and this is uh, the new one uh, before you install it make sure it fits it match you know the size and everything before you install it you don't want it to be too big or too small and uh, look like it fits just right so uh, here it is I'm going to install the, uh, the toilet seat on it. Okay, um, the way of the bolts work is uh, to drop it in like that. Drop it in and put the the arms or whatever you call it when it's not on. You can see this uh, those pieces right here. It catch on the groove of the screw, so you'll be fine. And now uh, you can do this to uh, slide them up on the bottom, uh, and then you can tie them up with uh, uh, with the uh, screwdriver. Uh, but first, you need to. Uh, Do a couple turn so it can catch on the uh, uh, on the plastic uh, plastic uh, screw. Try to do it with one hand and cut it hard. Okay, after you uh, tie up those uh, bolts, make sure it on the bottom all the way up tight and check out the uh, the toilet seat is not moving. Okay, install it back. All you have to do is put it in open position like this. Okay, snap it, snap it in, and turn it back to lock. Okay, turn it back to lock. Okay, so this is in the lock position. And now test it out. Open it up, close it, open it up, close it. Test it, see if it's moving. It's pretty good, stay solid. So this is uh, how you uh, install the uh, or replace the uh, toilet seat. Okay, thank you.